The NFL playoffs this year have been absolutely amazing. Like some of these games have come down to the wire and like just some of the create like the Saints and Vikings game. Like what? Cam steps into it. Pass is caught. Diggs! Sideline! Touchdown! Unbelievable! That was, I haven't really given my thoughts on that yet, but that was crazy. The Titans Chiefs game, the Jags Pittsburgh game. Like I am so excited to watch those next week's games. Like it's going to all be crazy. And I was like, I should take every single team and their quarterback. And I should see which QB can throw a 99 yard touchdown pass first with their team. Now, this is where you guys come in. All of you guys need to drop your predictions right now. I need a thousand comments on this video. And I know you guys can do it. A thousand comments, a thousand likes, because hit the like button and also kill the subscribe button. If you guys are new, guess who you guys think is going to win. And let me just show you guys on the screen exactly who our candidates are. So I'm sorry, that's not the team right there that's in it. The Titans, is my controller frozen? Yep. It is. Okay, give me one second. Okay, I'm back. Just had to switch out my controller for a second. So we got to go first off to the Vikings. Look at who we got. We have a guy by the name of Case Keenum. I'm a big Case Keenum fan. I love what he's done this year. I love the underdog stories. You guys know that. 80 speed, 83 excel, and they can literally get it anyway. So if I want to run it, I can do it. Keenum's obviously a pretty good athlete. The next guy on the list as we go down, we have from the New England Patriots, Tom Brady. The like larger than life figure that he is, Tom Brady. 62 speed. Uh, 660 cell. Obviously, I'm gonna be throwing the ball with Tom Brady. Then going down, we gotta find all of these guys. We have from the Jacksonville Jaguars, none other than the Blake Bortles, 79 speed, 82 acceleration, a more athletic QB, much like kind of like Case Keenum, uh, who really had a good game that last week. He was struggling up until that moment. Then we have from the Fly Eagles, Fly Nick Foles, the 6'6, 243 pound beast. Um, and yeah, they get to use the receivers. We're gonna be on Hall of Fame difficulty. Just whoever can do this in the least attempts. Okay, so here we go. Case Keenum is our first quarterback with this squad. Uh, we are going up against cover three defenses for both things. So don't be upset. I'm just going to use, I'm going to try and use my best cover three beaters, but we'll still be able to see what team can do it first. That's 0 for 1. Dang it, what am I doing? I, I was just trying to get the perfect throw, and I don't really regret that completely because I feel like I did make the right decision here. I'm just going to give Adam Thielen a chance because he is a beast. Okay, 0 for 2. In that method I think what I need to do is just get we they only have three guys deep we got five guys running get a bull rush over there that's exactly what I needed go R1 on a pass lead the right way we got him coach got him coach go 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 that's three attempts oh my gosh three attempts and I almost ruined it almost ruined it. okay put it up on the screen three attempts for Case Keenum against cover three that was crazy that was literally the one of the greatest throws I've ever seen we gotta rewatch that one I'm gonna show you guys what I did here to like not only take advantage of the defense because we're gonna be running that for all of them It's just it's competition between quarterbacks So I gotta do my best to score when you get here. I pass led this I had my joystick going completely to the right away from this guy I knew we had this guy beat I just wanted to go away from this safety because that's the only way you could get me So I pass it on his back shoulder just like that. So he catches it away from this dude it, It's something pass leading is so important in this game. That's how I got it with three attempts uh, beautiful execution next up we have Tom Brady and his crew okay so now we have the Patriots three is tough to beat, but like I said I'm trying to do this ASAP against cover three so I had to use another play that I believe gives us the best chance a play very similar I might even go with the same four verticals is just dominant against these type of defenses and it's okay so we went cover three sky oh we gotta move the play back the nerves are setting in because I'm trying to make this as fair as possible I Genuinely, they had a really good receiver in that slot position. I'm not going to change any receivers whatsoever. So if I feel that's not the best guy to throw to, so we got Danny Amendola in there. Okay, they're going bull rush, which is what I want to move up in the pocket. Go pass lead to the right. That's exactly what we want. But see, Amendola, and that wasn't a great throw from Tom Brady. I only have three attempts. So if this one goes poorly as well, uh, I'm going to have to change my strategy and see what I mean. It's not going to work for everyone. It really won't work for everyone. Okay, third attempt and last attempt for Tom Brady. I just want Gronk. Gronk, Cooks, everybody going deep. Let's see what we can do. They're sending a bull rush here, and I got sacked. Okay, we're going to give him one more shot because the fact that I got sacked is not fair, but it looks like, at least to begin, Case Keenum and that squad is going to have this competition um, taken over. Go deep to Gronk. Nope. and he cannot catch it. So the Patriots have officially been eliminated from the competition. Uh, let's see. Can I see how Amendola slows down there? It's almost like he doesn't have the arm strength 
to get it to him. When we had the Vikings, that throw seemed pretty easy, and it was just like absolute perfect execution. And with Brady, it's just not like that. Let's see, like rat catch, it's not happening with this team. Okay, Patriots are officially eliminated. Put the big X on the screen. It is time for the next contender. Okay, so with the Eagles, I'm gonna go same play, four verticals. I want to keep this all consistent. That that's what the challenge is all about. Just straight up consistency. So we're going this four verts type play. Get Nick Foles up in the pocket. I know Nick Foles has a cannon. Yeah, he can do it. Oh my gosh. First play of the whole thing. First play of the whole thing for the Philadelphia Eagles. Oh my gosh. They just did it. That is what they do. Okay, the Eagles are now in first. The only team that could potentially even like tie them would be Blake Bortles. But look at him. The throws that he's making. And like, I'm not saying that Brady's a bad quarterback. Brady was not making those same throws. And when it comes down to a competition of simply who is the best quarterback here in terms of some throws, in terms of 99 yard touchdown passes, you can't tell me that Nick Foles is not throwing the best ball consistently on that route. Every single time he's thrown this, it has been right on the money, an absolute dart, and it's just perfect. Like, look at this, roll out of the pocket, you pass lead right with the bullet pass, and the guy is just pretty much gone. So yeah, there we go. Eagles are now in first. The only way to tie would be if the Jaguars could get on the first try. Otherwise, Nick Foles, you are the surprise champion of the video. Okay, so here we go. Blake Bortles is up here. You'd have to get on his very first throw to make it happen. They went with a speed rush, which opens this up for me. Pass lead that way and no... Oh my gosh. And it is a no for the Jacksonville Jaguars. So when we think teams that can make big plays fast, the first team on your guys' list has to be, um, the Jags just got it on this attempt. The last team is the Patriots, okay? The first team is the Vikings. And no, I'm, I'm just all over there. The first team's the Eagles, the second team's the Jaguars, the third team is the um who else is even in it? i'm just a mess right. i don't even know what i'm talking about anymore i just want to say thank you guys all so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video um somewhat this is just the hail mary uh who can score fastest challenge the jaguars got on the second attempt in case you guys are wondering in case you guys haven't really been watching and you're kind of a little bit confused jags got on the second attempt uh but yeah move up in the pocket blake bortles this bullet throw to the right it's a great indication of arm strength and everything which is why i kind of made it the video and it appears it appears that nick Foles is the best at throwing this route and he really genuinely is no one else was able to throw it as good as nick Foles. thank you guys all so much for watching if you guys are the video make sure to drop a like down below and i'll see you all next time